So we're gonna start the bechamel with some butter. Usually it's equal parts butter and flour. So now that the butter is melted, we're gonna rain in our flour and we'll whisk it a little bit. So we're just gonna cook this mixture just a little bit to cook up the flour, then we'll add our milk. You have to stir it around a lot, otherwise the flour will burn. Okay, now that we cooked the flour a little bit, we're gonna go ahead and slowly add our milk. Ideally, you would want to warm the milk, less likelihood of clumping. If you go slowly, it's less likelihood of uh, forming clumps. We're gonna go ahead and put our previously sauteed kung ho in there, and we're gonna let it simmer for 10, 15 minutes. So this dish is really um, an east meets west dish. Uh, we're gonna use some shallot sauce to boost up the onion flavor. A little bit goes a long way. You can always add, but you can't take out. Season with some salt and pepper. Let it simmer for 10 to 15 minutes. It's been 15 minutes and look at that spinach. So the first time I made it, I used almond milk and it was one time I made this cream spinach, but I used cauliflower puree. You can really use your imagination. You don't need to stick to the book. And here you have cream spinach. 